I'm here with SGA member Robbie Mulcahy um, to find out a little bit about the behind the scenes planning of Loyola Palooza, which took place on Sunday, April 25th. Um, Robbie, what position do you hold for SGA? Uh, on the SGA this past year, I was Assistant Director of Finance. Okay, so what is your responsibility in planning Loyola Palooza with that as your position? Um, well, in conjunction with the Director of Finance, we both kind of work with all the members of the Executive Cabinet, which consists of about 12 or 13 members, and all of us together kind of um, plan Loyola Palooza. Uh, but specifically, I'm responsible for all the budgeting involved with Loyola Palooza, along with the Director of Finance, um, and all the money that goes into it, and things like that. Okay, so um, when does the planning start? Um, I mean, Matt Rose, the Director of Finance, and I, we budgeted for Loyola Palooza at the very end of last year. So planning starts about a year in advance. But we don't actually start looking for acts for Loyola Palooza until the beginning of this semester. Um, so, yeah. Okay. Um, the musical acts are probably the most important part of Loyola Palooza. How do you choose who you want to come? Well, the Vice President of Social Affairs, who this year was Ashley Bergman, is specifically um, responsible for choosing the musical act. So she works with a uh, agent who the school hires, I'm not really sure how that exactly works, but, and she brings a number of names to the entire executive cabinet, people who are available on the day of Loyal Palooza and who are in our price range, as Matt and I um, deem, we, we kind of set that price range so that she can look for acts within. Um, and then we all kind of choose uh, from that list that she gives us who we think would best fit the school's style and the Loyal Palooza style and um, the interests of the students. Okay, um, how do you actually go about getting the performer to come? Yes. Well, again, that's Ashley Bergman's main responsibility. Um, we really just kind of choose who we want to come, and then she works with the agents and then Eric Hutchinson for this year. Um, okay, and what are your responsibilities on the actual day of Loyola Palooza? Um, everybody gets assigned different jobs throughout, uh, like, I, this year, had to work Kitty Land, which usually everyone just, there's a big sign-up sheet, and we all have to work one um, table or thing like that. But most of the time, we usually get to enjoy a little palooza, but we have to work one or two shifts of one of the um, attractions or, you know, rides or things like that. Okay, and last thing, how do you think it went this year? I think it was very successful. Um, it was inside, which was kind of, uh, put a damper on things. It would have been better if it was outside, but considering it was inside, I think it was a pretty big success. Um, we had a great turnout for um, all three bands, and uh, from people I've talked to, they said they've had fun, had a good time, so we're pretty happy with it. All right, thank you. That was Robbie Mulcahy for SGA. Mm -hmm.